morning my loving Tiffany Thinks family and welcome back to another Vlogmas video. This morning Matt and I have decided we want to go for a walk but it is so cold outside so we need all the layers. Um, I've got our, look here, <laughs> I've got our matching Christmas pyjamas. I'm thinking we should put this on just for extra warmth and I'm going to wear big fluffy socks. I've got my hat on hat on already i was saying to matt it's nice wearing a hat because it just means you don't need to do anything to your hair you just you know i'll come and sort it out after um we just wanted to get up and just go on the go, go on a walk straight away because if we stay in we'll become really cozy and we won't want to go for a walk straight away i have been enjoying doing these little walks i said this before in a vlog but i have been enjoying doing little walks um and it'll be nice to have Matt with me today. This is Matt's favourite Christmas jumper because on the top you've got the skiing, um, the ski, people on the skis. <laughs> I'll wear the Santa socks today. Hats are on, coats are on, Christmas jumpers are on. Matching jumpers. The thing is, no one's gonna know what? that we've got Christmas jumpers underneath, which is good. So it's not that embarrassing. Hey, look, I've got a scarf on and a coat and a hat. And look at you. Oh, um, your Christmas scarf. jumper's on show. Yeah, get a scarf done. It might be cold. Do you know that TikTok's like, nobody's gonna know, but then... How will they know? How will they know? I, I can't remember it. Do you remember? Do you know? Nah, no, no one's gonna know. No one. How will they know? They're gonna know. They're gonna know. How will they know? <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> right, get your shoes on. We've been walking for the past maybe 15 minutes. And I want to say for 10 of those minutes, we've been talking about the coffee machine. <laughs> my nose is runny, but it's not cold. So I've taken my hat off and it's in my pocket. <laughs> <laughs> so Matt and I, I think we thought it's going to be a lot colder than it actually is. So Matt took his coat off and then I got hot and I took my coat off. And then there's people walking past. So Matt was like, right, I'm putting my coat on. We can't both be wearing the same jumper. <laughs> We're doing breathing exercises as we walk. We're back from our walk. I'm just taking this jumper off. That was such a nice walk. We walked for ages. We did a longer walk than we discussed, but it was such a beautiful day. So we just thought, let's do it. And we've also decided maybe on Christmas day or Christmas Eve, we, we want to do a long walk then as well, just because it's just so nice to get like clean air in. Um, so that was good. We're gonna have, Matt is gonna make fried potatoes for breakfast and I'm going to make eggs. So we're gonna have potatoes and eggs for breakfast, which is gonna be scrum diddly -umptious. Leftover spuds. No, thank you. I'm going to try the fried potato that Matt made. Cheers. Thanks, darling. Mmm. Right, Do you know what they're taste like? What? Hash browns, but yeah. better? Mmm, that was so good. Honestly, that's really good. If you've got potatoes, boil it, then cut it up, put it on the pan. Done. Fried potatoes. Some people think it's so weird that we have baked beans for breakfast. Yeah. But that's not just a, that's like a thing here. Everyone has baked beans. When you have a full English, people have baked beans. You can even have baked beans on toast. Um, but when you have breakfast, I thought it was a thing everywhere, but I didn't realize till some of the comments were saying, what, why are you having baked beans for breakfast? I opened up all the windows just to kind of get some clean air in and now I'm cold. Let me sort this out. <laughs> We're getting ready to go to Blue Water, but before we go there, um, it's a big shopping center. Before we go there, we're gonna go to a garden center just to have a look. Um, it's not too far from us, so we, I thought we'll just quickly pop in and see what's going on there. I went there last year with my sister. It's called Ruxley Manor. It's the most gorgeous garden center ever. And I want to show Matt all the Christmas decorations. I actually want to go for myself, but I'm telling Matt he needs to see it. I haven't gone there this year, so it'll be nice 
to see if they've done anything different. Right, moisturiser done. I'm going to buy a new concealer today just because all my old ones I've gotten rid of so I actually don't have any concealer and I feel like sometimes I just want to brighten up some areas on my face and concealer is the best. Um, whereas now I'm using foundation because I don't have concealer so oh I need to open my advent calendar don't I? Let's do that. Let me quickly put on this foundation and then we'll open number 15. You know since organising this room and just making it look cosy and feel cosy I feel like I'm using this room a lot more which is nice because it was empty for some time. Well it became one of those rooms you know when you don't use it and then you end up storing things in here that's what this room became for a little while and I knew I don't want that for this room. I have been using this clear brow gel ever since I got it. It's just really nice just to keep my eyebrows in place. I do need to, um, I do need to get my eyebrows done before Christmas. I'm going to use a little bit of powder just through my crease. That's my sister. Oh, I love it so much. Oh, yeah, we're, go we're going blue water. <laughs> and then I'll say, who's everybody? And she said, when you get, come here next Yeah, time. I'll do my New Year's nails there. Go have girls' nails day. And then we'll go out to eat. Cool. That's my sister and her friend. We're trying to organise... Oh, that's her again. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. Um, we are trying to organise afternoon tea. But I think that will be after Christmas because... It's just something to look forward to in January, uh, where things are so hectic right now. You know, when January comes around, everyone is a bit meh. You know, everyone's like, oh, you know, so I'm trying to do fun things in January too. We've got results coming up as well, but I'm not thinking about that. <laughs> Who cares about that? <laughs> right, let's do number 15. Oh, here it is. You know in the morning, as soon as I get up, I speak to my sister and I speak to my mum. Like, that's just something I do. Right, number 15 is... <gasps> Intensive Nail Repair Cream. Do you know who will love this? Matt, I've got something for you. This is for you. I don't know if you know this, but Matt runs and so his nails, he's always trying to sort out his toes. <laughs> is, that <t> <laughs> is that TMI? <laughs> This is the first time I've opened something and I'm not exact, like I'm not excited by it at all. I'm going to put on a little bit of blush just because I feel very flat. Yeah, we're popping into blue water because we just need to buy a few more Christmas presents and then we're done. We're absolutely done. We're here. Raxley Manor. It's <laughs> nice, isn't it? It's cute. We're here at Raxley. I've been here, okay, I think I put on way too much blush. I've been here before, but Matt hasn't, so I'm really excited to show him around. Honestly, this place is next level. You know how much I love the garden centre, don't you? Especially Dobby's, this is next level. It's like Dobby's on steroids. <laughs> the winter and it's cold I'm gonna sort out the inside of the house first and then I'll do the outside it's nice to walk around the garden center and get inspiration it's too cold to think about it now we're just focusing on Christmas now I need something for the front it's mahusive it's beautiful it's it was like to nice at the top did you think it was small from the yeah. outside
everything we got was actually discounted so I feel like we've got a really good deal I was expecting to pay 20 pounds for this but when we got to the till it was 10 pounds oh let's run through it I'm gonna quickly show you what we got it is honestly Matt were you surprised at how big it was what in there yeah it was unreal we had such we spent way long in there we honestly thought we were gonna be there we spent over an hour in there um, I got this I just thought it would look nice on the Christmas tree. We got Santa, and he's a sitting down Santa, and he's got in his um, sack, he's got a little snowball present, a Christmas tree, and he's got a little teddy bear on this side. He's cute. So Santa's gonna be sitting on my knee, and then, although I should be sitting on Santa's knee, We've got a little oven mitt as well. Everything we bought was discounted and I think it's because we've come kind of mid-December. I think if we had come December 1st or before December, this would have all been full price, but because it's kind of mid-December, maybe they just put the price down. Who knows? Well, maybe we just got lucky. Cheers. This is water mixed with squash. We're gonna do whatever. Mm -hmm. Next stop is blue water. I'm gonna put this right on the windowsill next to the Christmas tree. Every year Matt and I we always get um, a bauble, a new one for the tree and we didn't get one this year just because we've been really busy with doing things and house stuff and we haven't really bought one for the house so this is the one for this year. Love it. We always get one special bauble and we always say we want to keep it forever and ever and ever. Let's put this behind seatbelt on. We're here at Blue Water, we're just going to find parking. I need to buy Amma something and that's it, my Christmas is done, like Christmas shopping is done. <laughs> we're here. Oh. Vegetables and noodles. Oh my gosh, they've got orange chicken. Thank you. I'm not having any of the vegetables, that's all for Matt. Yeah, stay away from that. <laughs> I'm staying well away from the vegetables, but I'm having this really nice egg fried rice. Mmm. Look at this little bao bun. Look at this good. mini bao bun. It's a chicken one. Mmm. I really just wanted the rice. <laughs> it tastes fresh, doesn't it? I've got plain noodles as well. We are home now and I, oh sorry my earring, yeah, we are home now and I showed you everything we got at Rapsley Manor didn't I, I showed you when we were in the car, I got a few things which are presents but I'm not going to show you here, it's basically like pyjamas, socks, that kind of thing, I'm not showing you just in case, I don't think anyone watches these videos but just in case you know I think we're done now for presents we've done Matt's family and we've done mine I think we are done we've done friends as well I'm happy now because all we need to do is just wrap everything up which we can do whilst we watch Christmas movies in the background so that'll be fun I just I feel like we're missing someone you know when you write a list and you go over it again and again and again but you just feel like you're missing someone. That's what I keep thinking, like, who have we missed out? Um, anyways, I bought this. I really, I don't need thermals, right? Matt likes thermals inside and he always wears them. I like wearing leggings and the leggings that I wear, they're from Primark or New Look and they're not the best. They're very thin. They're okay in the summer, um, but now where it's super, super cold, I got these. These are thermal leggings. So I think they're, it says it's brushed inside for warmth. Is it just one legging in here? I think all my leggings have been, like, they're not as good quality as this. So it'd be nice to try this out. I can't believe there's only one pair. Look at that. 
Can you see inside? Oh my goodness, it's fleeced inside, so it's going to be super soft. I'll try this out. Matt and I, we've booked later on actually, it's not now. We're going to Kew Gardens uh, for the Christmas lights. We're doing that, I think that's next week. So I'll try this out then because that's probably the best time because it's going to be freezing in the night time and I'll report back and tell you if it's good or not. These were from m &S. I'll keep this with the packaging and then we'll try this out on Kew Gardens day, evening. Because I don't think I'm doing anything outside until then. This would have been perfect for bath because pop bath, when we were in bath, I was frozen. My legs were cold and the hand warmers really helped my hands, but my legs were cold. I need to, I'm gonna take this off, but I'm just so cold. I put the heating on and candles have been lit, ca uh, lamps have been put on. So I just, I'm just kind of defrosting and waiting for the house to warm up. I'm just waiting here. There's a radiator right here. I'm just waiting for the heater to start working. I'm going to start editing because I need to do that for tomorrow's video. I'll do that now. We had dinner there, so um, I felt, I just wanted rice. I was craving rice and just plain food. I've been very kind of, I don't know, especially for dinner time, I like having very light food. And I wanted to eat be because I didn't want to wait too long and come home and cook and then it's going to be just too long and it's going to be a nightmare for me at night time. So what we did is we had dinner there and um, Matt had all these vegetables and he had vegetables, noodles and chicken. I had bao buns which were delicious and I had plain rice, no egg fried rice and these really skinny noodles. It was just so good. It was plain and I stayed away from the vegetables since that day. I have been quite scared to eat vegetables. Normally I'll have a few and I'll really chew down on it, but I've just been staying away from everything. Even though Matt was like, do you want to try one? Because the vegetables, the vegetables apparently tasted really, really good. But I was like, you know what? I don't even want to risk it. So yeah, I'm happy with like sorted out dinner um, for, for today. And I'm happy with the dinner choice as well. It felt really fresh, especially the rice and noodles. It it didn't feel greasy or it just it just tasted really plain and that's what I wanted today. And my tummy feels absolutely good and yeah. <laughs> there are days that I'm craving crunchy vegetables. Like I would have loved to try the vegetables Matt was having having today having today. Um, it's weird because normally I'm tempted, if there's crunchy vegetables, I'm really tempted to have some and today's Matt's vegetables looked incredible because he said they put soy sauce and really nice flavouring. I looked over, it did look really tempting but I just thought, I don't need it, I'm happy with my egg fried rice and my bao buns. Honestly, bao buns are so delicious, aren't they? What are you having for dinner? Let me know. Um, I love food. <laughs> As you guys can tell, I really love food. So let me know what you're having for dinner. I'm going to find a little space for Santa near the Christmas tree, but I'm waiting for Matt to come out of the shower. We'll do it. All of us together. We're finding a little home for Santa. <laughs> you want to put him there, yeah? Oh, nice. Is he cozy there? He's looking over the presents. Yeah. Let's move this. To Does he need him. a present beside him? Something, maybe. <laughs> over to fill in the gap. A little bit messy. Yeah, maybe. With a couple of presents. Yeah, I like him. Yeah? It's good. Oh, he's so cute. Yeah, it's great, isn't it? Yeah, it's lovely. Wait, look at the other little thing. Is it a tree decoration? The tackier, the better, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, 100%. Yeah. yeah. This um, bauble is a very, very special one. One we're going to keep forever. This was Matt's nanny's, um, one of her decorations. And Matt's auntie sent this um, through the post. So we're going to keep this forever. And on every Christmas tree, we're going to put it on there. So that's nanny's decoration. You know, that's really nice. We've kept it next to um There is a tea. Why is the tea not on show? The tea's on the other side. Yeah, but we I should like... bring the tea out or no? No, I'm happy. I'm I think happy. we need the tea. Yeah, bring the tea around. Somewhere. 
Maybe at the bottom. Definitely. There you go. You happy? Yeah. Ski man, nannies, that thing. Candy cane. Okay. It's called a candy cane. <laughs> I love it. I think a Christmas tree has to be tacky. Yeah. Do you know it has to be tacky? Oh, loving it. It kind of doesn't match, but I love it. No, it's not meant to match. I think, also, it's a red and gold theme, so it does yeah. match. It's lovely, beautiful, beautiful Christmas tree. What do you all think? Do you think Santa should sit there on his own, or do you think he should sit with the presents? Let me show you again. Do you think he should sit there, like, watching over, or take the presents out and just leave him on his own? Not sure. I do love him though, a lot. We're having our cups of tea now, right? And we're having a discussion about chocolate biscuits. This is kind of what we're debating. My favorite chocolate biscuit here has to be this one, the fabulous chocolatey. So out of all of them, I won't eat all of them because you all know I don't like cookies. I don't, my favorite one is this chocolate one, the fabulous biscuit and jam and cream. I've never tried that before. I've had this before. Have you? It's very good. Little chocolate fudge sundae. Mm. Sounds unbelievable. Darling, which is your favourite? Like, if you had to pick your top three. Triple chocolate cookies. Those cookies. That one. Right. So. But I'm looking forward to trying that as well. Do you think that's and chocolate? And that, yes. And that. And that. That's my app. And that. This, this, and this. I think everything's made. Yeah, Matt loves. Best like, you know, biscuits I've ever yeah, seen. Yeah, he said this is his favourite. We also have an M&S one, but we're going to give the M&S one because um, we had a debate about this. Okay, so this is the M&S one and this is the Foxes. Matt says this one is just all about chocolate and he's saying he doesn't want just a chocolate in his biscuit. So we can't keep both because that's too many biscuits for the two of us. So this is the one we've decided to go for. Although this looks delicious, doesn't it? Look at all those biscuits. Ooh. Oh, is it two layers? Brilliant. Yeah. Well, Fantastic. that's lovely. What's that one doing like that? <laughs> <laughs> Wow, you get loads. Oh, there's only one of those. What? The, this one. one? We can share it. Double? There's only one. I want this one. But this oh, is right. only one in there. There's only one biscuit. That's madness. There's two of those. Cheers. Back in the days, it's these biscuits used to be full up right to the top. Yeah. Well, Matt's gone for the cookie. My yeah. typical Matt going for the cookie. I'm going for this one. We're watching Catering, Catering Christmas on Netflix. And if you want to have a laugh, please watch it. Me and Matt, we've, we've watched half of it this morning and we're finishing it off now. Sorry, I don't know if that, I don't know if you could hear me, but it's called, it's a new, um, it's a new movie on Netflix and it's called Catering Christmas. It's rubbish. <laughs> it is rubbish, like. Don't recommend it if you want it to be good. If you just want to see what kind of Christmas movies I watch, I love movies like this where the acting isn't the best, but it's very cheesy and the girl and guy fall in love at the end. And so this morning I said to Matt, right, let's watch a Christmas movie. Mm. I put this on and he's been laughing and he's making me laugh because they'll do scenes like, oh, I don't know where my camera is. And then the guy would be like, don't worry, I've got my camera here. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, it's really, really bad, but I love, love, love it. I love movies like this. You know, Hallmark mu Hallmark Christmas movies, that kind of vibe. It's not a movie I would recommend, but if you want to watch it, you can. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to go now. I love you all a lot, a lot, a lot. Thank you so much for watching my Vlogmas videos and for subscribing and for being part of my loving Tiffany Thinks family. If you want to subscribe, you can. It's completely free and you get notified anytime I upload a video. Tomorrow's video will be up at six o'clock, as always. If you want to subscribe, no, I said that. <laughs> Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok is Tiffany Thinks, and I'll see you tomorrow. Good night. Psh